Today we're going to take a look at the replacement electric trailer brake shoes and lining kit for the 7 inch brake assembly on 2,000 pound axles. Now this part is for a quantity of one wheel. Now the part will include everything shown here on the table, the two shoes, the two hold down clips. Now these brake shoes and linings are for electric trailer brakes that are on 2,000 pound axles. Now when these are installed they would measure across 7 inches and then the width of the pad is one and a quarter inch. Brake assemblies when they're determined they, or when they are listed they give the size of the brake assembly and the size basically means that if you measured, once these are installed on your assembly, if you measured straight across the diameter it would measure seven and a quarter inches when they're installed and then the width of the pad would be the one and a quarter inches. So that's how they determine the size of the brake assemblies. Now this does include the primary shoe and the secondary shoe and the way you can tell the difference on that if you look at the size of the pad you can see this pad is a little bit smaller than this pad. This one's a lot longer. The primary shoe will always go or always point towards the front of the trailer. So when you do install these, you want to make sure the primary shoe goes towards the front of the trailer, trailer and the secondary shoe, which is the larger one, would point towards the rear of the trailer. Now these parts are certified for SAE standards and CSA standards. The CSA standards are the Canadian standards. And when these are installed, these are designed to be used with 7-inch drums. But that should do it for the review of the replacement electric brake shoe line and lining kit for 7H brake assembly on 2,000 pound axles.